And we are on our way to a dentist appointment. Yeah. Uh, Jan, it's it's a a what are you yeah. getting? Your yeah, checkup, right? Uh, examination. Yeah, I'm gonna get a tooth pulled. Mm -hmm. so eventually. Eventually, but uh, boy. yeah, I'm gonna get an X-ray done and uh, you just disappeared in the glare. Uh, you just disappeared in the glare. You camouflaged with the glare. I guess I'm like that X-Man. Uh, a Marvel character. Mystique. Mystique. I can blend in with the environment. Nice. I'm like, uh, what's that character off of Metal Gear Solid? Just the, that no, five-board no, ninja that can blend in with the environment. I don't know. Come up below. If you know what it's talking about. Let's go. I do want to go to dance. We are going to the dentist, but for daddy, okay? Okay. Can I scoop it? Can I my scoop? No, Kiana already got her teeth checked out. Remember? Ooh. Yes. Out. Excuse me. No, my boo boo hurts. Your boo boo hurts. Okay, let's check it out. What you got? No. I got green pepper and tomato. Mm -hmm. You cooking on your food? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So where are we now? We're at Carolina Mall. Yep. We ain't been here for ages. New. We wait for my kinos to open up so we can get some spaghetti. <laughs> My spaghetti a la Venice. Kiona got chicken nuggets and fries. Dino nuggets. Yep, dino nuggets. And Ken got Greek spaghetti. Yep, feta cheese. Mm, feta mm. cheese like the best. Feta pizza. cheese is really good. Hey, you're not hungry? You blow it. <laughs> Kiona, you're supposed to be blowing your food, not the ear. You want some salt and pepper? Put some salt on it. You want some salt and pepper? Yeah. Yes, it. please. Put it on your french fries too. Good job. What is Sana doing? Sana, what are you doing? What is she doing? Is she tickling you? Is she tickling you? Go at it. What do you want? What do you want? Sana tickling you. <laughs> well, we're back and I'm back at my desk, guys. And look what I've got out. My Bermuda cookbook. Internet is being slow as molasses, so I got distracted. I'm looking up some recipes. If um, Actually, this is the old version. And I have the updated one, but sometimes I just like going through the older ones because the recipes are different anyway. Some of them, obviously, because they do updates and stuff, so they're my favorite. Um, yeah, if anyone wants to, uh, wants me to cook any specific Bermudian recipes, let me know. Oxtail, my another favorite, and lamb. <gasps> Favorites. Uh, anyone want to see me cook certain Bermudian recipes? I'm not sure how much of you know about Bermuda or want to know about Bermuda, but I'm from Bermuda, so I want to share that with you guys. <gasps> Oh, another one of my favorite banana bread. Pumpkin bread. I've never I've never made pumpkin bread, but the pumpkin bread at Starbucks is well. Oh, 
bran muffins. I have been looking for a recipe. Does it have raisins? Oh, it has raisins too. Oh, okay. Oh, Portuguese donuts. I didn't know this thing had Portuguese donuts. Oh, my goodness. Those are another favorite. Okay, so yeah. Ooh, some about apples. Apple brown Betty. Never heard of that, but it's got apples in it too. So I'm gonna try it. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see, ginger snaps. Oh my goodness, I got so tired. I don't like ginger snaps, but uh, when we was younger, so growing up, uh, you know, we weren't wealthy or anything, so we couldn't we couldn't get um, like a lot of snacks that were you know more expensive or whatever so all we all we would get is well my parents or or um so whoever was watching this would get ginger snaps oh, oh my goodness those things are terrible and that's all they got and i was so tired of them i hated them oh, i was thankful for the day that the last box of ginger snaps ran out and never came back <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness I was so thankful for that but some people really like them some people love them um but I don't I didn't like them however I do love sugar cookies actually actually see I've always been a hustler okay I've always um when I used to work I used to sell I actually no actually it started out in school I started selling sugar cookies somehow my aunt I think she because well my family was always like we always had big goods and stuff again because we couldn't buy cookies so we baked them so our house was always full of baked um, stuff cookies cakes my mama used to always make pies and everything and she always had me and my brothers in the kitchen um, baking with her, helping her with uh, whatever she was doing. So, uh, one of my aunts, she was the first one to order sugar cookies from me, and it was me specifically. So, um, that's really, I think that was my first ever business venture. And then after that, I used to sell sugar cookies and chocolate chip cookies at work, and they loved them. Um, yeah, I didn't why did I stop oh yeah they, I think they started to crack down on it but then I would <laughs> I would still sell them under the table so um and I was a good worker so I I wouldn't say it was the boss's pet but I could I could push the rules I'll put it that way um because I was a good worker I really was a hard worker um so she wasn't she she didn't like I didn't get any exceptions or anything like that but like if I was running late or anything she'd be more, she'd be understanding and stuff and I wasn't always I, it was in a habit and she was very understanding and um it was that kind of relationship um so yeah I've always <laughs> I've always been a hustler so now I'm doing my online thing and it's working it's working out and i'm real happy about it so uh let's see what else if you uh, if you have seen anything in the cookbook that you like just let me know in the comment box below um i'm just gonna keep flipping through the book for a little while oh actually i think i just hit the end um so anything appetizers desserts um i love to bake so um cookies cakes uh, banana bread bread um you know meats vegetables dessert I mean who don't like dessert anything oh corned beef yuck I hate corned beef that's another one was glad the last corn we can of corned beef ran out and never came in the house ah! <laughs> oh my goodness Bermuda fish chowder Bermuda fish chowder is really good. And I don't like fish. I only like Bermuda fish chowder. I don't like fish chowder. Only Bermuda fish chowder. Um, 
Lobster was always a treat. Uh, we used to uh, like once every uh, every time lobster season came in because lobster season was it's almost like deer hunting season and all the other different animals. It only comes in certain times, so you could only get lobster at certain times of the year. So when lobster season came in, you my dad and family and everyone would always go and get a lobster dinner lobster tail and our lobsters they're big like they're not like what you get at red lobster they're like three times that size um so yeah when we go to red lobster it's kind of a disappointment to get such a small lobster tail oh kima oh let me show you these two it's so cute okay now you see what's going on over here We've got the doggy, the doggy right there, and that's a cat, that's a cat, it's actually a kitten, but she's way past weaning age, and I guess she just does not want to give it up, she don't want to give it up, and Kima is not nursing, Kima is not nursing, she's not nursing. So, I'm not really sure what's going on over there. If she's just sucking on the like little, you know, knob or or what, but she, she she's not I don't think she's getting any milk. Oh, you know what? Maybe it's just the sucking that she misses. Because like I've heard I've heard like people like even like cigarette smokers or whatever when they come off of it they say that they miss the mouth action of it not necessarily the um nicotine once their body you know gets off of it but just the habit of it maybe that's what it is but these two have been doing this for a while now so like I i'm wondering what she's getting i don't know but Kima don't seem to mind. Here's another random one that I like. I don't like fish um, in general, but I I, well, I can't even say that I, I like it anymore because I haven't had it since I was a child. But I used to, I, I just remember, I used to love my grand, granny's um, shark hash. And I don't know where to get shark. I didn't, I never knew. I always asked my mama how to make it. And she didn't know how to um, make it. And I didn't even know this cookbook had it. So maybe I might try that. Maybe. <laughs> um, when I figure out where to get shark from. But I, uh, I've i heard this place in Charlotte sells different kind of um, ethnic, I guess you say, ingredients and stuff like that. Might also be able to find it at the Chinese... Uh, the China, there's like a Chinese uh, plaza type of thing in Charlotte too, and they have like a bunch of, they have like a bunch of huge tanks and stuff with different kinds of fish. Um, so yeah, codfish. Uh, where is it? Codfish. That's another thing that's very Bermudian. We do. Uh, Salted codfish, where it's like a dry, um, it's salted, dry, it's salted, so it's dry and uh, kind of chewy sometimes if you don't cook it right. Um, but I only like mine certain, uh, in a certain way. And the bacon sauce, this bacon sauce is really nice. Is this, let me see, tomato sauce? No, this one's different than what, uh, oh, this is a pie, that's why. But um, we do that and like do a tomato sauce and it has like bacon and fried onions and stuff like that on it. Um, it's really, it's actually really not bad. And that's coming from someone who don't like fish. So, um, and then how I used to like it. Uh, I liked it with the tomato sauce, but I also like it. My mom just used to do like a sauce with fried, um, it was just olive oil I like a lot of olive oil where it was a sauce and fry onions in it and that was really good that's how I eat it 
tomato soup, Bermuda onion soup. Yeah, so, okay, I think I, I bored everyone enough with this, but if you want, oh, macaroni and cheese, heart attack. This is different than what I do. But, um, yeah, if any, if you've seen anything, oh, Spanish rice, yes, another favorite, another favorite. Uh, okay, so if you've seen anything that you like or heard about anything, let me know in the comment box below and I will cook it for you. Okay, see you later.